Come on, wake up! Wake up! Welcome to Trivia Night, a labyrinth of despair and madness. Yeah, who needs rules? Let's get on with it. Okay now, first question. What kind of adorable animal is an ocelot? Use your device to answer the question. And the correct answer is... Who got the question right? Which means only you. Let's play a game. Welcome to the Killing Floor. We're going to play Chalices. I've given all the safe players a bit of poison to use. Pick a chalice to drop your poison in. And it's your turn now. Pick a chalice to drink from. You wouldn't believe how many renaissance fairs I had to go to to get- Mmm. Hope it tasted good. Now let's see what everyone drank. Brace yourself. Uh-oh, looks like somebody's a ghosty ghost. But keep playing and I promise you can still win. I take a picture of you, but I know it turned out poorly. It's early, but here are your scores. But don't get too high or too low because you're all doomed, remember? I've got more questions for you. And now for a segment I like to call, Questions for People Who Were Teenage Boys in 1999. On Late Night with Conan O'Brien, who was the character Mick Ferguson better known as? A surprise for you! Welcome back to the killing floor! It's time for some finger cutting. Fingers are overrated, right? Just choose one of your fingers to cut off. Could it be any easier? Think happy thoughts! Is it weird that I just love fingers? I guess anyone would say the same thing. Let's take another moment to appreciate this cool scoreboard, huh? How about this? How pure is sterling silver? to use your words. Use letters to spell the longest word you can before time runs out. It was really hard to find good cues to cut out. Don't be the person with the shortest word or you'll regret it. Do it now. The letters don't have to touch each other and remember to press submit when you're done. find something. Ooh, let's see what you did there. Is this what the kids would call an epic spelling fail? Hashtag epic spelling fail. LOL. Am I right? Totes. A tie? 
That's not good for anybody. Next question. What does the I stand for in GIF? And yes, I pronounce it with the G sound, not the J. And the correct answer is... this one. Let's play a game. Let's do a little memory test. Everyone gets to play this time. Memorize the pattern. Alright, let's put these away. From left to right, what was the order of the weapons? If anyone does better than you, I will kill you. Here's the pattern again, folks. How close did you get? But did anyone beat you? Now that's what I'm talking about. Whoa, this went from a simple murder party to a creepy sociological experiment. You were playing with some grim people. Oh look, only one player left. Perfect. Congrats on making it here alive. Now let's see if you can escape with your body. I'm going to give you a category. Countries with capitals that start with B. Tap on each answer that fits, then press submit. Let's see the right answers! You move forward one space for every correct answer. You're getting real close to the exit! Oh, did I mention that all the other ghosts get to play too? If a ghost catches up to you, then they will steal your body. Then they can escape and win the game. Here's everyone's next question. And ghosts get a third choice to help them catch up to you. Anytime today, kiddo. Magazine, sexiest man alive in the 90s. Time is almost up. Are you afraid of the dark? You should be. A bunch of smart people, huh? Here's another one. Harvard grads. Decisions, decisions. You killed your friend! Better get away fast. Too slow, so sad. Forced by great dogs.
time today, you know. So much blood! Hurry up! Founding new end members. Almost stop. Uh oh, that ghost is gonna get ya. And you're out of here. Girl Scout cookies. Decisions, decisions. Here comes the next question. What are you working on? Finish! Drummers. 